guys I'm just fitting a reversing camera to this smart um, 4.2 and I'll just show you quickly how the camera goes where it goes and what you might want to do but my son Noah here with me today He's just coming from holiday hey say hey Noah hey. right so I put the camera just here like that yeah so the whole boot lid is off now it just unscrews so there's the screws around there and it comes off so I've got the wire for the reversing camera coming through the back here and these this this car already had a, a dash cam at the back so they were already holes drilled into the bumper like this hole was already here just had to make it a little bit bigger normally I would have gone up this way but as a hole was there I just went with it in hindsight I should have gone with the one up there so it's much nicer and neater anyway so this is the camera connections and now I've got the yellow wire which is the video cable and this is the power camera power wire for the camera I've connected the red wire from the video cable to this red wire here so that when the reverse camera turns on it's also going to send power up this cable so that I can use it as my trigger wire for the back of the radio all right so remember that you need to make your connection look like this all right guys so i've put the boot back together remember what i showed you with the camera so now this is where the wire gone i couldn't get the wire through the grommet to this little rubber sleeve that i would normally do it's too thin with too many wires going through it i didn't really want to compromise it anymore so i've left it on the other side not the best looking thing but it's just a tiny tiny bit it's coming through there i just got to pull this seal back through here now and you'll see then I'm going to fit some parking sensors as well. Isn't it, Noah? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to end up looking like this. Yeah. End up looking a bit like that. Just about to put some parking sensors on it now. I've just I had a mark right down the middle of the car. And I measured 16 mil, 16 inches or 16 inches that way. And I got a, um, so I've got symmetry across the middle of the back. And then bang in the middle on either side. Right. So this is the um, reverse light wire and the earth. So the brown is the earth, the red and yellow is the live. You can see I've got two sets of power supplies going to it. One's for the parking sensors and one's for the reversing camera. It's kind of a load being put on this um, reverse light. So if it does give any issues, maybe a relay wiring job might be the one for it. But hopefully not. These parking sensors, I've only wired them up as a two sensor system, so we've got C and D plugged in. So when it starts up, we get two beeps, which is like trying to say there's a fault with two sensors, but there isn't. It's just um, the way it's going to be. So, I'm reversing wire here. It's running. Running through there, under the carpet. Under the carpet here, under the carpet, under the carpet. I brought it all the way up the corner here, I'm going up up there. And then I'm taking the radio out. Take the radio out, you just pop it with the trim remover, and it comes out like that. You've got some screws, four screws to take the radio out, and you can run that cable. So look, well, we've got the camera working, but that's upside down, isn't it? Look, the can's upside down, this, the radio is right way up, but the camera's upside down, so we've got to flip the camera over. So luckily, there's the camera, we've got the screws on the side, and this actually looks like you can do a complete 180, which is great. So the camera came out like this and we've got to turn it around like that and bolt it back up again. Happy days. You Alright, so the camera's in and it's all working like it should. Noah, we'll jump in this side for me and press the brakes. Come around this side. That's the parking sensor working Which as well. Brakes? Come on, try you tell me. Uh, this one? Uh, that one. Which one really do you think it is? Yeah. This one. Yeah? Hmm? 
Tell me with your engineering brain, which one do you think will be better, the best to be the brake? Um, that's the gas. That's the brake. Why? Because it looks like a brake. Any other reason? Mm, no. I think it's a bigger one because it's more important to be able to stop. Yeah. Press the brake. Press the brake and unlock it by continue neutral. Happy day. So then you select reverse again. Like that. That's the parking sensor turning on. So we are working. We are earn business, you know? Yeah. Well done mate, we're done. Hey, you finally done. Yellow point, red.